Uh, let's get over to Christophe in France. Christophe, Christophe how are you? Bonjour. Hello, Kabob. Hello, Rick and Petit Sarai. Bonjour, monsieur. Bonjour. You, you look in good health on Kabob today. But you didn't say I just spoke to you in French. Bonjour. Bonjour. Okay. I didn't know whether you spoke French or not. Okay, go ahead. Oh, Thursday. It's a very special day for me because it's the day uh, of the week where I will meet you and uh, I can talk with you, Uncle Bob. Well, thank you. I'm very happy to hear that. I appreciate it and I enjoy talking Uncle to you. Uncle Bob, uh, yes. I, I like your sense of humor to put a picture on the barrel on the new new wall, wallpaper on the background of the show. I hate the scandalous newspaper. They said that you drink uh, wine uh, during the show. I don't drink wine in the show. I drink coffee. I'd, I'd love to drink a little wine if you want to send some over. Okay. No, but no. I drink uh, coffee. I Black. know, yes. All right. What else? Um, I have prepared a uh, few questions. First, uh, I love when you tell you... Uh, uh, so, sorry. I, I love when you tell your attempt to, to incorporate the Marines uh, when you were as a teenager. Uh, you have lied uh, about your age to being incorporated. Uh, can you tell us one more time this story that I, that I love hearing? The story that you love hearing about me well, as a well, teenager? Well, when you were a teenager, you, you want to, to incorporate the Marines. The incorporate... Oh, the Marines. When you try oh, to join the, the Marines. Marines. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The I Marines. joined the Marines yeah. when I was 15 years old with Peter Cantos, who was my dearest, dearest, dearest friend. Yes. And we went in there, and we were on our way to boot camp. And they said uh, my name, and I said to Peter, see, that's what I like about Marines. They understand leadership. And I just said, yes, sir. And he said, go home. I said, sir. He said, go <laughs> home. Your mother called. You're 15. And I, I like went, this story, Uncle Bob. No, I don't like it. And I went to Peter, and I said, Peter, I'm going home. I'm 15. <laughs> and we both looked at each other and hugged each other and started to cry. And there are the two Marines, uh, one 18, Peter, and one 15, Robert. And then he went to Korea and never returned, and uh, I went uh, home to mother. That is a funny story. <laughs> okay. <didn't> go home. <laughs> What's the next story? Come on. My, my, my next question, I wanted to ask you, how did you perform your, your military service uh, in what Army Corps was? It would have, have been if I had done it, the Marine Corps, but it didn't happen because I was too young. Uh, I want to know, um, I, I what, uh, I what degree have you finished your military service? I didn't finish it because it didn't happen. Move on. What's the next question? <laughs> uh, to finish, I wanted to know um, if you have kept some friends about their, about their period of your life uh, when you were a military. No, there was nothing no. to discuss for something that never happened. But I appreciate your inquiry and. If it ever happens in my in my dream column, I'll call you and say, "Guess what? Here's what happened." But anyway, that's it. Okay. Okay, come up. That's it. Uh, thanks a lot uh, for answering my question and share all these uh, stories of your life uh, with with us. Uh, to conclude my call, um, I, I can only repeat my admiration that I have for you and pride to be part of this radio adventure. I, I love you deeply. Hey, God bless you, man. Thanks for your friendship, and thanks uh, for your participation in your show. And don't forget what I just said, it, your show. Thank you. My show, it's my pleasure, Uncle Bob. God Thank bless you. you. God bless you. Au revoir. Au revoir. There we go. You know, I just decided, Bob, I think I'm going to shave the beard tonight. <laughs> yeah, all right, all right.